Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be in my mini seasonal happy planner and I'm going to be planning March 26th through April 1st, which happens to be April Fool's Day and Easter. And if you guys came from my last video, I totally forgot that it was Easter and my classic plan with me. But in this spread, I am going to go for more of an Easter spread because I actually am planning this after that video. I hope I'm not alone. <laughs> I hope I'm not alone, but I'm gonna go in with this seasonal mini sticker book. This sticker actually in my hand for in my hands right now is actually from the seasonal teacher sticker book that is a red sticker book that came out last summer. If I can find that, I know it's not sold at a whole bunch of places anymore, but if I can find it, I will have that link down below. As always, everything that I use in this plan with me, I will have a link to it down below so you guys can pick it up. It's just right underneath my video, right kind of where the subscribe button is. Um, so you guys can go check that out. I love this banner so much. I think this is so cute. And this is actually not in the seasonal sticker book. It was in the, I think it was in like the holiday sticker book, the green one that's from the memory keeping line. They have some really cute Easter stickers in there as well, and this banner was so cute. I just couldn't help myself. I had to use it. As you can see, the things are already coming off. I just wasn't crazy about the scallop on the left side, and on the right side, I like it for a while, and then I will go in and change that. So I do really love that. That was also on the same page as that banner in that sticker book, the memory keeping one. I added that to-go sticker because normally we go downtown Kansas City and walk around. It's normally beautiful here in April, but it could snow. Um, still here in April, it could be stormy and tornadoes and all different kinds of like crazy things could be going on. And I'm checking the weather right now and there is a snowflake. So hopefully that does not happen, um, but it definitely can happen. It could go into, like we could get snow in May here. So um, it's definitely different than a lot of other states, but I hope it's going to be sunny because it was beautiful last year when we went and it's always fun to walk around and just get your exercise but also hang out with family and friends and shop a little bit. I am loving this sticker smile. It's spring. I think it is super fun and the colors go really well with the rest of the spread so far. Um, I did go in next with the colorful boxes just to mark the days of the week that I want to upload. You guys will probably get familiar with the sticker book. I will probably use it in like every single plan with me video because I just love it. I think it goes with any color scheme or if you're going to use decorative stickers, it just, those boxes just go perfectly. So right now I'm just kind of going in and I'm going to move this around because I do want to upload Monday, Thursday, and Saturday this week. And thumbs this video up if you guys want to see more of a schedule on my channel. I'm really trying to work on that and work some kinks out a little bit. But I would kind of like to do like Monday, Thursday, and Saturday. So thumbs this video up if you like that schedule too. I decided to add some pink instead of the green because I felt like there was too much green on there and then I did decide to take off that scallop sticker underneath the note section. And how cute is the sun sticker? I had to add that. Hoping and praying for sun this weekend. And just like that, the pages are out of the discs. 
sometimes I take them out just to help me if I'm going to be using the little stencils, especially in the mini. These are a little bit harder, the stencils to use with the discs because the pages aren't big enough. Um, they're a little bit smaller, obviously, than the classic or the big. So I'm going in with these stencils and I'm going to go in with the Paper Mate Flare and also the Tombow Twin Tone Pins just to create kind of a little checklist for me throughout the week. I really wanted this spread to be more of a decorative and functional spread, so I always love using the stencils. Those help me and I really like checking things off. So I'm going in with the Paper Mate Flare right now. Now I'm going to go in with the Tombow Twin Tone pins. I get a lot of questions about what pins I'm using. These are the pastels right here and then the brights are right here. I will have a link to those down below if you guys are interested. I always get questions about these pins and right now they're $12 on Amazon so definitely go check them out if you're interested. I am going to the farmer's market with my mom on Saturday and I always love using the note section as like extra room for your weekend to highlight events or do a checklist for your weekend. So that is what I'm using that for. And I'm jumping ahead here. I used the kind of moved things around on you guys. My camera battery died and then my memory card filled up. So this is the end result of what everything looks like. I figured I'd still upload this video even though the last little bit is kind of like changed really quick for you guys. I still love how this turned out. I love all the bright colors and I think it's super fun for Easter and for spring. So if you guys enjoyed this video, I would love to know. Let me know in the comments and also by giving this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, I'd love to have you stick around and make sure you hit that subscribe button and I'll catch you guys in my next one. Bye guys!